Alexa, open a street door. What's your voice code for street door? One, two, three, four. Unlocking. Hang on. The street door is locked. Hello, everyone. For this project, I decided to control my street door with Alexa. And for this project, I want to use uh, Synric Pro. Uh, it's kind of service um, so useful if you want to uh, control any device with your Alexa, you can use Synric Pro. Uh, you just need uh, sign up and already I did it before, I just log in and uh, it's easy you go to device you add any device you want of course you have to uh, add this skill in your amazon i choose a sm smart lock you can choose a room and there is some configuration it depends to which kind of device you are adding but it's uh, pretty simple and you can control kind of any device and this finished you have one device and as you see you can see one uh, red dot because uh, it didn't connect yet is disconnected because I didn't upload to um, my ESP32 yet uh, for this purpose, uh, purpose you go to tutorial you can find uh, many SDK I'm using Arduino examples we go to examples we find lock yeah lock lock with feedback yeah it's their example just we need to a uh, little change I copy paste all of it here we have to write our SSID and our password right now I'm not writing we copy the device ID the app key and app secret you can find it in credentials here you can copy this much simple just you need to copy here okay just uh, we need to change something uh, I want to tell you because it's uh, in a street door uh, just is you know it's kind of relay it just should work for uh, half second 500 millisecond uh, I go and I make a delay after 500 millisecond I turn it off again this much simple and um, after 500 millisecond I want to send the state to the server like okay this opened and after 500 millisecond uh, locked again uh, in example they have uh, check lock state uh, I want to change this because um, I don't need it I want to change it to kind of send uh, lock state as you see these lines we don't need because uh, in the example they are reading from one input but we don't have any input just I want to send the uh, current state okay and I after one second I will send the lucky state to false because you say it's luck um, so it's the situation and it's finished we need to remove this function and we are ready just I wanna uh, check yeah everything is fine
Okay, I want to change some things. Uh, we have right now the problem if uh, the Wi-Fi disconnect this uh, will not connect again. Uh, but in with this function, uh, with you know with this condition, every three second we are checking if uh, we need to reconnect. We reconnect. Okay, we say we we come by less sketch. Uh, this much easy. Uh, you don't worry. You can find the uh, full documentation in the website. We compile a sketch, and uh, right now we are going to uh, upload it to our ESP32. It's connecting. Connecting, yeah, and uploading to ESP32. Don't worry, as you see, just in five, six minutes we can. Uh, and final step is my ESP32. I put it in the one case and in my fuse box. Um, this much just. Uh, as you see, there is a relay that you can find the relay everywhere and I with one wire inside the wall I uh, connected uh, parallel that relay to this button that uh, always I open the door and uh, this much uh, easy and I will cover the fuse box with this so no one can see anything that I can control the um, my S3 door with Alexa or uh, Alexa application. Alexa, open a street door. What's your voice code for street door? One, two, three, four. Unlocking, hang on. The street door is locked. <laughs> 